Yeah, here we've got a uh, 925, 25 foot grain table. It's traded in. I'm gonna set it down. We're gonna describe the top. I want to show you the bottom. It needs poly. Needs poly, and uh, you can see right here, it's got a few dings in the in the center of the auger. It is a poly, a factory poly style. I'll get the year in a minute. It does have some barber shopping. On the, uh, it's got some barber shopping on the on the fingers. We didn't clean it up. It just came in. It was a trade in on a full fingered head. Um, he actually had two of these heads, and he was using the, and he was using this one here. Uh, like I say, the poly is very weak. It's missing a lot of poly. We're going to look at the auger from up top. I'll set it down. I'll get you the year of it too. It was. It is a factory poly snout that was traded in on a full finger. The 666,000 serial number. So that should put it like a 1996 model, I believe. Yeah, it should be a 1996 model, but it's got some barbershop teeth on it. It does have a. Uh, it does have a sprocket in here, and it's got the shaft laying in here. Guys, this head's no cream puff, okay? It is not a cream puff. You can tell by the by that the poly underneath's not very good, but it does have the poly stouts. Um, it does have a few dings in the center of the auger, which we'll try. We're trying to fix for the best we can. Uh, but you'll just see. I mean, it's been into it. He used it. He told me. He said it's just. I want a nice head. I had a nice full fingered head that fit his newer combine. But it is sprocket type hookup. So they've got the sprocket here. And then that shaft that's down here inside the auger also has a sprocket hook to it, okay? The one I showed you. So evidently they use that to extend out to get to where they need to on the combine. But it's got that uh, extension in it. You're getting all that with it. Um, I just left the snouts in instead of putting them on there because you guys are probably going to want out to haul it anyway. <clears throat> it's going to be sold absolute on Tractor House Auction. Uh, it does have uh, hydraulic fore and aft on the reel. See right here, it's got the cylinders on it here. I can see the one on the other side. So it does have hydraulic fore and aft on the reel. And um, like I say, just, just an average hit. You're going to buy it absolute on Tractor House Auction.